In our rush to screen the population for disease, we risk losing sight of a truth once taught to every medical student. First, do no harm. I'm Phil Ross, a senior editor at IEEE Spectrum magazine, and our current issue covers a non-medical screen, lie detection. Like many medical screens, and more than most, a lie detector is truly useful only if it catches just about all the liars without fingering too many honest people. Say you're the CIA. Say you're screening 100 people for a job. Say three of those people are spies, and your system catches two out of three. You'll still have one spy running loose in your operation, biding her time, waiting for the call to come to blow up the world. There you have it, the plot for Angelina Jolie's latest movie, Salt. Now, some medical tests make good sense. Take the screen for high blood pressure. It ends up costing some people a little bit of money, and it ends up putting some people into therapy that they would probably not have needed, because a lot of people with high blood pressure never develop a disease that stems from that high blood pressure. But the side effects of the treatment are so small, and the benefits are so clear, it makes good sense to get yourself screened. Some screening tests, however, can panic people into getting treatments with truly horrendous side effects. Take the screen for prostate cancer. I'm 54 years old. For men my age, there's a between a one in four and a one in three chance of having biopsy detectable prostate cancer. It so happens that the vast majority of men with such cancer will never suffer from it, never even know they had it. But if they go in to be tested for it, they can easily get onto the medical treadmill that leads them to prostatectomy, which means, in many cases, impotence, incontinence, bowel problems, and other complications. If every man in the country got screened for prostate cancer all the way through to a biopsy, it would be very bad news indeed. We have gone from being healthy until proven sick to the very reverse. And this is a bad thing. For the call.